Hey guys, welcome back to Electrical Car Repair Life. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel, guys. If you have a Ford Focus, guys, and you have any of the following two codes, guys, I'm talking about code P0441 or code P0442. Stay with us, guys, and we'll explain what uh, uh, what can cause those codes, guys. Now, uh, we have a Ford Focus here, third generation, guys, MK3, so it should work from year 2012 to year 2018-19, but even for the previous generation as well. Those codes guys are uh, known as EVAP or uh, uh, emission, emission system codes guys and uh, with this code you cannot pass inspection, you cannot pass emissions because you will be polluting the air and we will explain why. Now quick introduction guys, we have more than 200 videos on this car and every car we get at the shop because our mission is to save you guys as much money as we can. So please guys subscribe to the channel and like the video, hopefully guys we can save you some serious money and headache as well. Now. It doesn't matter which engine you have guys on your Ford Ford because if it's a 2.0, 1.0, if you have guys like a 1.6 uh, These codes guys, okay, uh, are triggered by something super simple and we'll explain now what As you know guys, you have fuel in your fuel tank which is uh, right uh, in front of the rear axle That fuel guys, when the car sits, you drive it, it gets hot That fuel creates vapors, those vapors guys expand and creates pressure and in the past, those vapors used to just be released in the atmosphere. But now, uh, pollution guys, you don't want to pollute the atmosphere. And second, the car is not so efficient because you're just evaporating your fuel. They created uh, that EVAP system guys that takes the vapors from the fuel tank and brings it to the engine through the purge valve guys. This is the line right here. You can see you have two lines. Okay, right there. One is fuel line, one is uh, the emission line. Right there. And it brings the vapors, guys, from the uh, fuel tank to the intake manifold, from the intake manifold in the cylinders, and it burns through the engine, and the engine is more efficient, and you get better fuel. Now, but what causes that, guys? That tells us that there is a leak somewhere in, in the system. And on Ford Focus, guys, okay, something is super, okay, uh, that uh, super advanced, you can see no cap, device on that Ford Focus can cause you sometimes headache if it's older um, if the seals and all that stuff gets cracked on the inside you can guys develop EVAP leaks the emission leaks that will actually let that gas vapors to come out of here and you won't be able to build pressure in the fuel tank and you will not be able to activate the purge control valve and the system will detect that it's not working so on older vehicles guys Ford vehicles used to have the fuel cap and on the fuel cap you have a, a like a rubber seal okay let me see actually if there is one right here so i can show you quick uh, that way you know what i'm talking about okay let me see yep right there we have a fuel cap right here guys and on that fuel cap you have that seal okay that if it cracks, it will activate these two codes, P0441 and P0442. So you replace the seal. That used to be, uh, that used to be, guys, the scenario with those. This is an older Ford vehicle. But as you can see now, uh, they started using, okay, they started using that capless device, guys. And that can malfunction the same way. It has a seal on the inside and it's supposed to get locked up. It's supposed to get locked up to the point that, okay, pressure or when you fill up your car okay you're supposed to just uh, not be able okay to push that valve here okay let me let me show you here now that valve you're not supposed to push it in it's supposed to be released guys when you push these two teeth on the side that means that it's okay that valve okay now it's stuck but sometimes it's not stuck guys and what causes now fault in the mechanism guys being old wore out so when you get gas get more gas guys why because that way you don't have to use that device so much so as you know guys when you fill up gas at the gas station or that's your funnel for emergency feeling you're going to push it in and when uh, that thing gets here okay it's going to push these two things these two teeth and it's going to activate the valve now the valve is closed, oh, and now it's not. You can see that valve does not always closes all the way. And the seal on the inside is broken, that causes a leak. So in that case, you have to replace your capless thing here, guys. It's a no-cap device, so uh, 
uh, we have a video on the channel we'll, we'll make a video how to do that so make sure guys you check it out on the channel that's what can calls these two calls guys p0441 and called p0442 so hopefully the video will be helpful thank you for watching and see you guys next time